Hello, and welcome to another installment of Hanging with Dr. Origami. And today, we're making an origami triangular pyramid. Most of my other videos require a square piece of paper, but this one requires a sheet of regular printer paper of any color. The first step is to take the right edge of the paper and bring it up to the top, like so. We'll take this edge and bring it up to the top. And as always, the more symmetrical your folds, the better your final product will be. Next, take your left edge and fold it over so it folds over this side right here. So it's gonna overlap. Next, unfold both folds. So unfold the left and unfold the right. And then refold your left inside. So now you have a square piece of paper. Next, using your diagonal as a guide, you're gonna take this bottom part of the left flap and bring it over to the left. So from here up to here. Again, just from here to here. From there, you're gonna take your piece of paper and fold it in half rectangularly. So from the bottom up to the top. And fold. Unfold it, rotate it 90 degrees, and do the same thing. Fold it up from the bottom to the top. Then unfold. Now you're gonna take each corner and fold it toward the middle. So from here, up to the middle, then next corner, up to the middle, and then this corner, up to the middle, and your last corner, up to the middle. From here, you're going to unfold all four corners and rotate your paper toward the beginning where your overhang flap is going to be facing the right. From here, you're going to take this bottom edge, this bottom left edge, and fold it up to this line. So from here to here. Then you're gonna unfold it. And we just created this diagonal line. You're not gonna fold this same edge, but to that diagonal line we just created. So from here, just up to here. So again, we fold it up to the first line, then unfold it, and then up to the new line. From there, leave that folded as it is. Now, take this top corner, this top right corner, and you're gonna kind of hold these midpoints down and push up from the bottom so that this is going to collapse and fold onto itself, like so. And you end up with a triangular wedge like this. So again, we were here. It works best if you hold down your midpoints from the top and the right sides 
and kind of scoop underneath and bring it together so it forms a triangular wedge. And then bring your top left corner to meet it. Okay. One more time, we were here. Hold down your midpoints and come up from the bottom. Squeeze together so that just this edge comes together to make a triangle. And then bring your top left to meet it. From here, using this line as your midpoint, you're gonna fold this down and in. And then let that go. Take this right edge and overlap it over. Like here. And then you have a little pocket here from the overhang flap. And you're gonna tuck this piece in that pocket like so and you have your pyramid again one more time we brought these together you're going to fold it down and that's going to be one part of your base you're going to take the flap on the right and fold it over that's going to be the second part of your base. And then this part right here, the little pocket from the overhang flap from the beginning of the project. You're going to tuck this in there. And that completes your base. And turn it over. And you now have a triangular pyramid. This has been Hanging with Dr. Origami. If you liked the video, please give me a like and subscribe below, and I hope you have a great day. Talk to you later.